Many people lost everything as they ran for their lives from those brush fires. Now they need clothing, important documents, and much more. A new assistance center has opened up to help folks get back on their feet. Kick Nine's Rachel Kim is live right now in Thousand Oaks at the Grant Brimhall Library with more details in the story tonight. Rachel? Yeah, Jeff, this library will be home to that assistance center until Tuesday. Organizers say they know how overwhelming this process can be if your home was damaged, destroyed, or if you were significantly impacted by these fires. So they want to make things a lot easier. Eileen Mickens walked into the local assistance center almost a week after her possessions and home of 17 years in Malibu was destroyed by the fires. I lost everything that I received from my mom, from my grandparents, from a baby grand piano to China. I lost my wedding album. I lost my children's baby albums. Despite the loss of the things that are irreplaceable, Eileen must now focus on starting over with a new home. She brought a lot of questions. Where to start, how to rebuild our home, how to afford rebuilding our home. Eileen says she was able to get a lot of answers here. The county of Ventura and the city of Thousand Oaks opened the local assistance center today at the Grant Brimhall Library in Thousand Oaks. It's a one stop resource for residents affected by the Hill and Woolsey fires. We have the um, Department of Vital Records from the state. They can help get you some of the, like, like marriage certificates, uh, uh, death certificates, those kinds of things that people have lost. There's also information on things like debris removal, permits, housing and rental assistance, public health, property assessments, even services to replace your driver's license. If you need to bring your kids, there's a place for them too. We're trying to be as accommodating as we can to folks, and we just encourage folks to come out and see what we have here. If you plan on coming, you're asked to bring whatever ID and documents you still have. FEMA is here, and so people that want to sign up for disaster assistance through FEMA and possible loans and grants, they're here for that. This center is primarily for Ventura County residents. LA County is planning to open up one soon in the next few days. But if you're an LA County resident like Eileen, you can get state services here. Just people need to know about this, that's all. Because it, to have everything in one location is really helpful. Again, this center will be here until Tuesday, Friday, Monday, and Tuesday. The hours will be 9 a.m. to 7 p.m. On the weekend, Saturday and Sunday, it'll be 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. You're encouraged to come out. Reporting live tonight in Thousand Oaks, Rachel Kim, KCAL 9 News. And stay with KCAL 9 News for continued coverage of California's deadly wildfires. For updates anytime, just go to KCAL9.com.